Hey everyone, in this video I'll show you how to easily remove a green screen using Shortcut Editor. So here I have two video clips added to the playlist in Shotcut. Now let's go ahead and add these clips to the timeline. Navigate here to the timeline menu, track operations, and then add video track. Okay, let's now add second video track. Okay, now let's take this main clip and drag and drop it to video track one and the green screen video to video track two. Perfect. Now let's adjust the duration of this green screen video to match the main clip just like this okay now if you want to remove this green screen all we have to do is just select this uh, green screen video in track 2 navigate to filters click on the add button and in the search box type in and find the filter called chroma key simple now select this filter and as you can see the green screen has been removed if it's not the case uh, for you, then just navigate here to key color, select this color picker, navigate over the color that you want to remove, left click, and you should see the same effect. Now, if I play this clip, you can see the green screen is gone, but we're still left with a bit of this green outline that we want to remove. And to do that, we just need to use this distance slider and adjust it so that the green line is not visible. And that's it guys this is how we remove green screen in shotcut now if you also want to reposition or resize your object then just make sure you select this green screen video go to filters again add a filter and in the search box type in and find a filter called size position and rotate okay now you will notice this border appearing on your video and also this little circle in the middle so if you just click on any of these um, corners left click drag and this is how you're able to simply resize your object if i click here in the middle i can just drag the object around the screen and position it where i want so let's say i'll place it here i can even resize it further like this now go back here replay and this is it guys so i hope this tutorial was useful please don't forget to like the video subscribe to the channel and see you in the next tutorial